the friendship with your ex-wife. Yeah, but it hurts to watch somebody lose faith in you. Well, everybody else believes you Superman. You're not doing your part. I'm trying to raise a responsible young lady while you're trying to raise girls going wild. Don't call me. I feel like I'm disposable, and it kind of makes me a little sad. I like moving forward. But I love you. You're my brother. That's a trailer clip of What the Flocka, Waka and Tammy. The reality show is back for season three tonight on WeTV. And this season will be filled with more ups and downs. You just saw it there as it follows Waka and Tammy navigating divorce, co-parenting, and new life changes. And this morning, Waka Flocka joins us live to talk all about the new show, show and more. Good morning. Good morning. How you doing, Grand Rosie? Yeah. All right. Good morning to you. Good morning to you. Hey, real quick, right off the top. So this is the third season of the show without giving away all the secrets. Yeah. Um, from season one to, to now, what have you uh, learned during this whole process of reality TV and, and your life as well, mixing it all together? Uh, my, my synopsis, uh, I watched the whole season one, two, and three. I realized, man, I, I learned how to become a man. I was a boy man when I started. Meaning I had a lot of immature ways. I had a lot of uh, doubts. I had some insecurities. I didn't have as much as confidence. And just like right right now, man, it's the most happiest, most peaceful I'm at ever in my life. You know, when y'all say divorce, it just be sounding harsh. It's like a separation. Mm -hmm. It's just graceful. I think that, that relationship brought the better out of me and the better out of her. So whatever the future holds, I think that's in God's hand. All right. Um, and I know, too, the show this season will look at uh, co-parenting. But what do you make of some fans of the show who have been following it who go, they're not together anymore, so, so why are they still doing the reality show? What do you make of that? And then also, what's your aim and the takeaway for viewers? Um, the fact that you said, why will we do the show, I think it's more selfish for us not to do the show. Yeah. Because people are actually following it. Uh, I think that the takeaway from this, the, to be honest with you, I actually haven't even seen it. Uh, but I, who, what I, who I am and what I stand for, I just want people to know, man, even when somebody's together or separated, man, y'all can still be graceful doing it. That shit, it don't got to come with hate. Like, I, I feel like people get this, this divorce thing and just slaughter each other. Mm -hmm. To me, when you slaughter each other in a relationship, y'all never had love in the first place because love don't leave and love don't disappear. Mm -hmm. And if it do, it's never meant to be in the first place. So for me, as a man, I, I'm happy. Like, I, I, sh I can't wait to see what Tammy become new. I can't wait to see how she's on her journey in life. I can't wait to see my daughter be 21. My daughter just drove from school to my house. <laughs> I can't worry about that's an, that's an amazing thing. Yes. Uh, real quick, uh, real quick before we go, any regrets, whether it's uh, doing this on TV, putting every, all, your, all your, you know, your family business out on TV, any regrets? Would you do it over again if you could change anything? Uh, probably the only regret I have is being insensible. Uh, learning, I felt victim of a quote that I always hear everybody say all my life has been a young man. Man, you got to get your queen, get your woman in, and put her in position. And that's where I went wrong because putting a woman in a position is building a cage around her. I think you can never position anybody in life. Only thing you could do is help become a life coach as they go into their position gradually. Uh, I just learned a lot. My quality, man, this is actually my first like real relationship in my life. So I just learned a lot, like a whole lot. It's unexplainable. I'm not here to like get a sorrow. Sorry, I'm not sad. I don't regret anything. That's probably the only thing I do regret. Yeah, I know we're out of time, but I want to congratulate you. I know about two years ago you received your honorary doctorate in humanitarianism and, and philanthropy. So we want to make sure we get that in there. Congrats on all your successes. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you so much. And many more. All right. All right. Congratulations and continued success. Thank you, Waka Flocka. We appreciate it. All right, y'all. Peace. And just a reminder, you can catch the season three premiere of What the Flocka, Waka and Tammy tonight on WeTV.